Raphael Leo versus Verat Helio in other rivalries. So I'm going to put them in three different rivalries to see who can do better. We're starting off with a different one this time. A Turkish League rivalry. I'll put Raphael Leo on Galatasaray and Verat Helio on Fenerbahce. Let's see who will do better in the first rivalry. Neither of them actually won the league, but Fenerbahce finished higher in the league. They also beat Galatasaray in the Turkish Cup final. And Galatasaray got grouped in the Champions League and Fenerbahce lost in the Conference League semi-finals. Raphael Leo got 22 goals and 12 assists. And Verat Helio got 32 goals with 15 assists which is a lot better. So the first rivalry clearly goes to Verat. Helio. Next is the London rivalry. Raphael Leo on Chelsea and Verat Helio on Tottenham. Let's see who will win this one. Chelsea got fourth and Tottenham could only get eight. Chelsea did win the FA Cup and neither could win the Carabao Cup. Raphael Leo got 24 goals and 14 assists. And Verat Helio got 22 goals and 3 assists. So this round is obviously going to Raphael Leo. So it comes down to the El Clasico rivalry as always. I have decided to put Raphael Leo on Real Madrid to follow Ronaldo's footsteps as the next Portuguese left winger and Verat Helio on Barcelona. No other reason. It's a bit random but let's see who can win. Barcelona actually won the La Liga. They even beat Real Madrid in the Super Copa final. But Real Madrid did win the Copa de España. Real Madrid lost in the Champions League semi finals. Oh my god, Barcelona got grouped. But they did actually win the Europa League. Rafael Leo got 19 goals and 14 assists. And Verat Helio got 24 goals and 17 assists. So I'm giving this to Verat Helio, and that also means he has won the challenge.